Hello, Geminis. How are you doing? Welcome to Silavi Tarot. I hope you are doing phenomenal. Let's take a look and see what's going on with you during this time. Okay, let's see what's going on with you in love more so. Please check out the description box below for any additional information that you would need, like personal readings, okay? And also, if this resonates with you, please consider subscribing, okay? So let's see what's going on with my gems. What's the vibe? for Gemini. Thank you. <laughs> Soul level connection dream come true. Wow, Gemini. Very strong connection in your um, environment, in your energy at this time. Okay, bottom of the deck, we have I'm sorry. All right, so someone here wanting to apologize for their behavior. A lot of you could be dealing with another air sign or a Pisces I'm getting or a Virgo. I'm also hearing Taurus. But there's a strong energy of you know, when I met you, when we connected, it was something that I didn't really imagine. I didn't imagine that I would um, connect so deeply with someone to this capacity. So I feel like there is a very strong connection that you are embracing with someone at this time. Um, and I feel like someone here is a bit apologetic. Of course, take that how that resonates for you. But someone here is a bit apologetic here. And I feel like it could have been, again, because this person wasn't really showing their true intentions or showing their true desires it was something about the way this person was presenting themselves that just wasn't authentic and i feel like because you were very intuitive you started picking up on that vibe you started picking up that this person wasn't really showing you their true nature and i feel like both of you know that the minute that we connected it was speechless it was um just amazing all right the the love was instant the attraction chemistry passion desire was instant and i feel like this person sort of um try to at times pull away or at times play down this connection and i feel like this is someone here is that is wanting to apologize wanting to come forward and ooh, look at this in the back here just hiding so we have a lot of you this could be someone from your past okay someone from your past here okay and for a lot of you just the way that was just hiding like that it's like could be somebody that you possibly didn't expect that would come up or someone that you didn't expect to feel this way but they truly do and i feel like this person is so apologetic it's like i truly would love to apologize and because of sometimes ego or sometimes um the situation that i may be in presently that i haven't really told you about i haven't been able to come forward and express my my love to you or, or how i truly feel so someone here hasn't really been in a place where they've been very expressive and that could be you gemini you know not being completely honest with someone in terms of how you're feeling but someone here is hoping that this is um something that could go into a long-term vibe uh, vibration i should say is there anything else about this person that gemini's are connecting with that we need to know thank you soulmate like this is just perfect gemini and we have i miss you Okay, so someone here is missing you very, very deeply, not really expressing it, of course, here, because I get this energy of someone at some point they were hiding or they weren't really talking or they weren't really expressing, again, their feelings. But again, we have, again, you are my soulmate. You are the person that I desire to connect with. You are the person that I want to be with. Honestly, there could be some sort of distance in terms of traveling or again, a, the two of you haven't really been communicating over um, some sort of misunderstanding that could have transpired at some point. But I do see again, it's like, I want to connect with you. I'm sorry for possibly doing certain things. So something must have happened here. And again, you know, everybody has a specific issue, right? But I do feel like someone here wants to come in and reconnect a lot of you could be dealing with a cancer scorpio or pisces energy but i again you are my dream come true you are my soulmate and again for a lot of you this is just someone again instantly when we met this was compatibility at sight compatibility okay and i feel like this person is missing you okay missing your touch missing your energy missing your vibes all right now we also have an energy of phone call wanting to come in um, someone here wanting to communicate. And I feel like for some of my Geminis that may be watching, it's like I've been trying to or I've tried to connect with this person on numerous occasions. But for some reason, you know, I haven't been able to get through. And because of that, um, I felt like it was one sided at some point. I felt like I was the only one trying to reach out. And I do miss you, you know, and at times I'm afraid of saying that to you because I've said it so much and there hasn't really been any feedback. So I'm in this place of 
sort of imbalance here. This could have been someone, again, that did something to you that was very, very hurtful, okay? Some of my Geminis or something that they said, something that they did was very hurtful. But now they're coming into this place where they're saying, wow, grass isn't greener on the other side. Or if it isn't a third party situation, the way that they're acting, they're saying, hey, look, I'm sorry. And I actually do miss you. Okay, some of you, there could be children involved in this scenario, but this is someone here from your past, from what I'm getting, all right? Now, some of you may be connecting with a new person, um, but again, it's like I'm getting a lot of past energy here, okay? So some of you could be balancing out two people in your environment at this time. What other messages do we have for my beautiful Geminis here pertaining to this connection? What do they need to know, spirit? Geminis. Thank you. Time. Okay. So someone here is in a place where it's saying, you know, I feel like you've taken so much time to really come forward or this has been something that's repetitive. Okay. So a lot of you are feeling like this person has been showing you the same, you know, same energy escape. Someone here left. Someone here left when things got hard. Okay. And I feel like someone here is at the place or energy where they're saying, hey, look, you know, you've taken so long. There was so many lies. There was so many deception. There was so much um, hurt here. I'm afraid that, you know, I don't feel the same trust. Okay. There's something about trust here, but I don't feel like this person wants to give up. By lying, I ripped us apart. So there was some sort of lie that you felt like this person told you here. Okay. One more, please, for my Geminis. One more, please, Geminis habits here. I don't know if we will ever change. Wow. Okay. Someone here is looking at the scenario and they're saying, Hey, look, I need some more time to think about this situation. And I feel like a lot of you Gemini will start thinking like this once this person comes in and they start saying, Hey, look, I understand your side of the story. So this is someone here that I feel like that's having this awakening that's starting to understand where you're coming from. And again, this comes or stems from a place of you Gemini pulling back or you, you know, really focusing on your self growth here. And now this person's wanting to possibly come in apologize and restart this connection i truly and even in the beginning of the reading i was feeling like there's someone here not only does this person feel deeply for you but they feel like you are their soulmate so this person doesn't really feel like you know this is over for them although they've done some things that would definitely contribute to that conclusion but i do not feel like this person's in a place where they're wanting to end things at all and that's for most of my gemini's that are watching okay so let's get and look at this reconciliation at the bottom of the deck. All right. Someone from your past is returning to your life, Gemini, or someone's not wanting to let go. What else do we have for my Gemini's where? Whoop. Okay. Attraction. All right. So there's still that energy of attraction. I'm still attracted to your vibe. I'm still attracted to your heart. I'm still attracted to you. Spirit, give me more for my Gemini's. I'm still attracted to you. Okay, there's a lot of wedding. A lot of you could have been married to this person or you talked about marriage. Um, and they're saying that this situation involves marriage. So some of you could be dealing with someone that's possibly trying to come out of a, a marriage or this person is still trying to figure their self. Someone here is not happy in a marriage. Okay, there's a, a, a topic about marriage here and someone's not happy in that energy or this person is in a place where, you know, there could be some wedding or marriage or engagement energy going on here for some of you. Take that how that resonates. But I feel like either way, this person's still attracted to you, whether this is someone that you're married to, someone you were married to, and there, there's that strong vibration of I'm attracted to you. All right. And we have chemistry. Like I stated, all right, there's a strong magnetic attraction between the two of you. And I feel like this person's not wanting to completely, you know, disregard that as we have very soon here. OK, uh, it's also saying Gemini clearly decide what it is that you want. OK, so that you could attract that energy because I don't, again, feel like this person is letting you go. Some of you may be dealing with someone with a Gemini moon or a Gemini rising. OK, is from what I'm getting, but heavy Gemini placements, okay, Je Gemini, Mars, or Jupiter, where this person's very good with their words, they're saying, but someone here is saying, hey, look, I miss you. Let's reconnect. Let's fix this. Let's not completely dis, you know, disconnect from this here, because I feel like at some point, this person started to understand what you meant to them, okay? Again, engagement. Something about engagement. Some of you could, again, 
sore yourself with this person long term. You're like, this is the person I want to be with. It says your life is ascending, your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. It's like, again, I'm not disconnecting from you. I'm not letting you go. I'm just working on myself. I'm working on trying to stabilize myself, but I love you. Okay. I definitely love you. I keep getting a message of someone here trying to figure out between two people. Okay. Take that, how that resonates for you. And we have, I need more time to think. I feel like this is you, Gemini, possibly telling this person that after possibly, you know, finding something out about this person. Okay. Any advice for my beautiful Geminis, please? What is the advice that my Geminis need? Thank you. Abandonment issues here. Okay. Some of you have been feeling extremely abandoned by this person. Okay. And I feel like spirit is going to bring in some sort of stability for you. Okay. It's like, I feel like I've been alone. I'm sort of feeling dis discouraged. I'm here. I'm feeling discouraged here. This person comes back in here. Okay. This person could have heavy fire placements in their chart. Okay, I feel like that's a past energy and we're stepping into this energy of stability. Gemini, you are in a place where you are more motivated now to go after what it is that you want. And I feel like there is a lot of you that are going to actually be in a relationship moving forward in the next four weeks, three to four weeks. There's going to be some sort of relationship offer that comes in for you, Gemini. And I feel like it's coming from someone again that's saying, hey, look, let's compromise. Let's work on something here. Okay. Thank you. Yep. I'm going to reach out and let's do it. Yeah. I'm reaching out. I'm reconnecting. I want to start something new. You know, how can I fix this disappointment that I've created or how can I fix this, um, you know, vibration that I've created? But I do see someone here reaching out to you, Gemini, wanting to come in and wanting to start something over with you. All right. So expect a call, expect some sort of communication, expect some sort of call or communication that comes out of nowhere for a lot of you. Okay. Is there anything else my Gemini's need to know? Gemini, Sun, Moon, Venus signs, please. Of course, subscribe if this resonates with you, please. What else do we have for my Gemini spirit? Thank you. Yep. This person is ready to give. I'm ready to give. Okay. I'm ready to heal this situation. I'm ready to fix the situation. Now I feel like this is someone here in the past that wasn't giving as much as you were giving, but I see this person with the temperance energy could be a Sagittarius you're connecting with again, uh, our earth sign. Um, but I do feel like someone here wants to balance things out. I want to bring things into a peaceful place in, um, between us. And I feel like that's exactly what this person is planning to do moving forward here. Okay. So let's get some messages, Gemini. I hope this resonated with you here. Um, but spirit is saying to be patient. All right. To be patient with yourself and also connect with those that are open to giving. All right. Because I do see a strong soulmate connection wanting to come in. Victory. Okay, free yourself from situations that are not, you know, really conducive to you here. But I feel like a lot of you are going to get some sort of clarity pertaining to a love situation here. And it's definitely coming in from this individual that has been acting like a friend or acting like things aren't serious between you two. And they're coming in to give you clarity. Spirit is coming in to give you clarity within this whole scenario. Okay, let's see if we can get one more. All right. Hostilities. Uh, also, Gemini, some of you, they're asking for you to hear this person out. Some of you may be in this place where it's like, I'm sort of in a place where I have my guard up with this person. But um, listen to this person as they come in, because I feel like this person has a lot to say. And we have a door to personal healing and happiness. Okay, so there is some sort of healing that's happening for a lot of you here. I'm getting a vibration of a cancer. So a lot of you could be, um, you know, have a cancer placement or a lot of cancer placements in your chart, but or cancer or Leo. But either way here, I'm getting someone here wanting to balance things out. And Gemini, I feel like this is you um, personally, right? Where I'm opening the door up for happiness for myself, healing for me and doing things that are actually more balanced um, for me in my in my life here. So I love you, Gemini. Have a beautiful one. Um, please check out the description box below um, if you're interested in any personal reading. And of course, have a beautiful week. Thank you. Bye.